Today's a day where two people that love each other till death becomes one. Yes, that's right guys, I'm actually going to a wedding today. The main reason why my uncle and I had this whole trip planned out was because of the wedding that we're going to. Um, my uncle's friend's son is getting married and my uncle was like, hey, why don't we go touring around this area when I need to go to that wedding anyway. So that's why we're here. But the wedding starts at two o'clock and right now it's currently 11 o'clock. So we need to kill three hours. So right now I'm actually walking inside this nice palace area with nice trees and actually it's a tomb for a king so a king that used to live I guess died and <laughs> there's a tomb here for that so that's what we're here to see but it's really relaxing as you can see really nice breeze quiet see these big hills that you see around me there's one on my left right here these hills were actually the burial sites for the kings the kings got a huge big hill with burial sites and they got all their possessions or some of their possessions buried with them hence why it's so big but a king is buried right there These sculptures are actually represents the year of the animal. So this is the year of the dog right here, year of the pig is right there, and the year of the rooster or the chicken, yeah, it's right there. So it's actually pretty cool. It's all 12 of them here. That was fun. It's always nice to just get out, take time for yourself, take a stroll, you know, rejuvenate that energy to get excited again because, you know, I can't be down for a wedding, right? I could be excited for that wedding, so let's go! I'm here. That was a lot of fun. I love weddings. I love when two people love each other that much that they are willing to spend the rest of their lives together. It's something just words can't describe how beautiful it is. But I'm curious between me and all of my friends, who's gonna take the plunge and get married first? To be honest with you, that's kind of... It was a very short wedding. There was no like I do process where you know they ask you about, oh, are you willing to spend a life or you're or you willing to spend the rest of your life with this person through death do you part like they wasn't that person apparently there's two different types of weddings and this wasn't the type so actually very short the actual wedding reception itself was probably around like 30 to 45 minutes long it was very very short but it's very sweet very cute you know again marriages are just a beautiful thing but now we're as you can see i'm in the restaurant the buffet so it's time to dig in. I forgot to mention, this is kind of weird for me because I don't know any of the people here. Like, it's my uncle's friend's son, right? So I obviously don't know anybody, but still, amazing wedding, beautiful wedding. Something that I won't forget because you know, I saw a wedding in Korea. Well, just a quick message for the newly married couple. I wish you happiness, joy, and success in your future together, and I hope you guys have a beautiful married life. But it's time for me to go home. I 
arrive at my favorite place again. Yep, it's the highway rest stop. We just stopped to get some ice cream and get a small little drink. It is like a four hour drive, so, but it's not as big as the other one, but it still has a lot of stuff. It still even has a convenience store in it, so it's still pretty big. We need something like this in Canada, like seriously.